Hello everyone. You are welcome to how to solve this very nice system of equations. X squared minus Y squared is equal to 28 and XY is equal to 48. Our job is to find all possible values of X plus Y. So let's start. Let's call this equation equation 1 and this equation equation 2. And we square both sides of uh, equation 1. Equation 1 is uh, X squared minus y squared is equal to 28 and we square both sides of this equation. So by using this algebraic identity a minus b whole squared is equal to a squared plus b squared minus 2ab. This x squared minus y squared whole squared will become x squared whole squared plus y squared whole squared minus 2 times x squared y squared is equal to 28 squared is equal to 784. Now this uh, x squared whole squared will become x to the power 4 plus this uh, y squared whole squared will become y to the power 4 minus 2 times this uh, x squared y squared can be written as uh, x times y whole squared is equal to 784. And we replace this uh, x times y with this value of x times y 48 from equation 2. So this will become x to the power 4 plus uh, y to the power 4 minus 2 times uh, value of x y is uh, 48 squared is equal to 784. Next x to the power 4 plus uh, y to the power 4 minus 2 times 48 squared is 2304 is equal to 784. Next x to the power 4 plus y to the power 4 minus 2 times 2304 will become 4608 is equal to 700. 84. Now we move this uh, negative 4608 to the right hand side. So this will become x to the power 4 plus uh, y to the power 4 is equal to 784 plus uh, 4608. Next, x to the power 4 plus uh, y to the power 4 is equal to 784 plus 4608 will become 5392. Now we make this left hand side a perfect square. So we write this x to the power 4 as x squared whole squared plus we write this y to the power 4 as y squared whole squared and we add 2 times x squared y squared is equal to 5392. Since we have added 2x squared y squared at left hand side, so we add 2 times x squared y squared at the right hand side. Now by using this algebraic identity a squared plus b squared plus 2ab is equal to a plus b whole squared. This expression at the left hand side will become x squared plus y squared whole squared is equal to 5392 plus 2 times we can write this x squared y squared as uh, x times y whole square 
and we replace this x y with the value of x y 48 from equation 2 from equation 2 x times y is equal to 48 so this will become x squared plus uh, y squared whole squared is equal to 5392 plus 2 times value of xy is 48 squared. Next, x squared plus y squared whole squared is equal to 5392 plus 2 times 48 squared is 2304. Next, x squared plus uh, y squared whole squared is equal to 5392 plus uh, 2 times uh, 2304 will become 4608. Next, x squared plus uh, y squared whole squared is equal to 5392 plus 4608 will become 10,000. Now we take square root of both sides. So this square will be cancelled out with this square root and at left hand side we are left with the x squared plus uh, y squared is equal to plus or minus square root of 10,000 is uh, 100. It means uh, we have two values of x squared plus y squared. x squared plus uh, y squared is equal to 100 and uh, x squared plus uh, y squared is equal to negative 100. Now this value x squared is uh, greater than 0 and this value y squared is also greater than 0 and sum of uh, two positive numbers cannot be negative. So we reject this value of uh, x squared y squared. Now by using this algebraic identity a squared plus uh, b squared is equal to a plus b whole squared minus 2 a b. This x squared plus uh, y squared will become x plus y whole squared minus 2 times x y is equal to 100. Now we replace uh, this x y with the value of x y 48. From equation 2, x times y is equal to 48. So, this will become x plus y whole squared minus 2 times value of x y 48 is equal to 100. Next, x plus y whole squared minus 2 times 48 will become 96 is equal to 100. We move this uh, negative 96 to the right hand side. So this will become x plus y whole squared is equal to 100 plus uh, 96. Next x plus y whole squared is equal to this will become 196. Now we take a square root of both sides. So this square will be cancelled out with this square root and we get the value of x plus y is equal to plus or minus square root of 196 is 14. It means we get two values of x plus y, x plus y is equal to 14 and uh, x plus y 
is equal to negative 14. These are the two solutions of this equation.